Hello my convicts and convicts. yes it is I, the Kappa Convict, bringing you guys and gals a new gameplay. So here we are, we're just about to drop into some more Titanfall 2. Now why are we going into Titanfall 2, I can hear you cry. Well I actually wanted to do something today and actually wanted to see about the new weapon coming in Season 2 to, in fact, Apex Legends. So let's have a look at it and let's see what we can do with the L-Star. Yes, we're going to play Titanfall 2 to jump in and actually look at it. Before we do, here it is the L-Star. This is the weapon that's going to be put into the supply drops or the drop ships, whatever you want to call them, the, the care packages, whatever they are. And this is going to be a gold weapon. It's going to be the rapid firing energy LMG known as the L Star. Now I've not got any attachments as such apart from the increased ammo. I've just literally got that now. And I thought we'd jump into a game and see if it is as good as what they say it is. So without further ado, here we go. So let me know in the comments below, have you got Titanfall 2? Have you tried out the L-Star? Let me know what you think of it in the comments below. I'm pretty pumped to see if it's actually any good. So just waiting to join a game. As you can see here, I've picked some games I want to jump into. I kind of like attrition and I like the uh, player versus player matches as well. But it's just us and no Goliaths dropping into match because they they are pretty dominating a lot of the time. Okay, so we've entered into a late game. And they're five up on us. Now we're five up on them. Right, here we go. Okay, a lot of people here. Just kill all these people. Hi right, buddy, you're not getting away now. Shooting at me. Hi. Get out of my way. Thank you. I don't know what I'm to do, Glenn. No, he's, he's not a player. Oh, I'm getting bombed. Yep, I'm a pilot. Yep, that's what I do. Who was throwing grenades? I wish the pilots were a little bit more distinctive to their team or the, the AI bots because it's very hard to obviously notice them at a glance. Obviously you can see what they look like with the battery on the back and that's what you need to be looking for. But as you can see, very difficult to see from here that that is not a pilot, it's a grunt. Oh, I didn't see him. He might have just spawned there, possibly, because we are on the corner. Wow, what's he using? What the hell is that? It's the Mastiff. He's got the Mastiff, that's why. Okay. Yeah, we do. I'm a pilot. Well, I'm not on your team. Shut up. You're annoying me now. Right, so he's got a um, a mastiff. And I've got a deployable shield, as you can see. That just basically means I can deploy it down like this. Give us hard cover, and there we go. You can't shoot with me, but I can shoot you. Oh. I don't know if that's true, but it'll like it from there. Okay, we've got our Titan. Generally, I've kind of not been using the Titan as much. I've just been enjoying more shooting, and if I have to do rocket the other Titans, you drop it down. Hi, buddy, you can die now. Hi. Don't mind me. What is that he got? Is that the Afrio one? Looks like it doesn't it from here. Um anybody? No? Okay. 
There's my Titan, let me drop him by now. Might as well use him a little bit. For the content. Over here. Let's make sure no one's trying to rodeo with me. It takes a little bit for my feet to charge my smoke. Always go for a Titan straight away as soon as they drop if it's an enemy one because they can't use the electric smoke. he drops in. Oh, even, even if, uh, if I can avoid from getting shot. As soon as he drops in, he can't use his electric smoke to start off with. He physically has to wait for so long for the electric smoke to turn up before he can actually use it. Okay, we're going to do it up here. You alright there, buddy? <laughs> I got it. Uh, okay, so they can now see us through the map and through walls. So I need to be just a little bit careful. Okay. He's using my gun. The L star. Let's get closer, AI dudes. Okay. That um, confused the crap out of me. Where did he go? Oh, there. Hi. That looks like you don't need to reload the L star either. Obviously, in Apex, it's not going to have a clip anyway because it's a gold item. So once you run out of it, you run out of it. No, you're not. I'm not tight on the to shoot me. Too sneaky. Oh, nope, that missed. And it looks like this has unlimited ammo as well, by the look of it. Because it doesn't give you a number for the ammo. I take one of them. And take one of them. Oh, I'm 
like to then swap to my secondary, which is the Prowler. Ah! I'm gonna fucking trick this guy. Stay still. I've got that time from here, I'll squash him. Couldn't do anything. There's just far too much going on there. That's probably one of the worst drops I've ever had with the Titan. Oh, well I got him down. I got him I got him to almost dead. definitely don't need to reload this either on this game. You can just shoot it, it just overheats I think. Just quickly get over here. One thing I don't understand though about Apex and this is the actual sliding and stuff in this game is way better look, than it is in Apex Legends. Apex Legends, the sliding that's very buggy in this game is absolutely spot on. So how did they make that so wrong? Uh, they obviously designed the game to work like that. Okay, didn't quite catch it. Oh, okay, you're cheating, are you? No. Nice try, buddy. Oh god, that's getting me off to death. <laughs> I was like, ah! Luckily, it's just an AI Spectre. Okay, I know my time's up ready. Here you go. Then. On him. Whoa, who's that? Jimmy. Ah, uh, I thought it was the electric smoke thing. There we go. Get up. One in there, get him, buddy. He's gonna come. my thing back, you little worm. Yeah. Get out of my face. <laughs> I think that was a little bit overkill, but there we have it. Can you stop shooting at me? get in and we get out. I've still got my smart pistol. What this basically does is it auto locks onto people, even pilots. So it is kind of a bit, you know, OP in a sense. But you can still be killed pretty easy with it. Uh, there we 
go. Do that grunt. I've got some hard cover here as well. Bye. Get out of it, grunt. No. My dude. I can't find any players such a shooter, which is kind of annoying. But oh, I'm not taking him on. He's a bit big for me. There we go. As you can see, that's how good it is against uh, pilot. That dude had no clue what was going on. Oh, fun. I thought I had my little boost, but I don't. Left to drop my uh, thing. Oh, ooh, we killed each other. Okay. Righty ho. Deploy my Titan over there. Why not? You beat. Oh, okay. So as you can see, we, we did okay, we killed 12 people. It was a bit difficult to find people, to be honest. This is why I, um, one of the reasons why I played Titan. But there we have it, Titanfall 2, the L-Star. I think it's not too bad. I think if they're going to bring it in though, they said it's very powerful. I don't know where that is in terms of like the how it uses, because I, f I feel like, especially in Titanfall 2, it's very underpowered. Uh, from what I, I could see and the f the fire of the actual gun is really really slow so I, I don't know how much more powerful that's going to be in terms of the way it can be used in Apex Legends if you use it if it's like it is in Titanfall 2 then it's definitely going to be an ADS must sort of weapon it's not going to be one of those you can just hip fire a bit like the Mastiff the Mastiff is pretty decent for hip shot but it is much more devastating to aim and shoot with it because it's more powerful that way. But there you have it, the L Star. So far, I think it's okay. Obviously, they might do some changes to it once it comes into Apex Legends, which what might make it super powerful. But for now, I just think it's kind of mediocre-ish uh, at the moment. And obviously, there's new hub ops or hop ups, what you want to call them in Apex Legends, if you've not heard of them as well. Some giving more power to the very underpowered weapons, such as the Mozambique and the P2020. There's gonna be a hop-up uh, hop that's going to make them very, very good. There's gonna also be an energy one as well, which is going to give the energy weapons more ammo capacity as well. So you can have more, uh, um, you can have more energy, like an extended mag for your energy, or it's gonna do something along that region. Um, and it, I think the energy is going to do more damage to the shields as well. So it's going to drain your shields faster. I know there's a hop up that will also damage your shields that can be used with the other light firing weapons, which will be able to then take off your shield really, really, really quickly in Apex and then obviously do deal damage to you. So. Yeah, some differences. I can't remember which ones are what, so I'll probably mix and match some of them there to what each hop-up uh, hop is uh, is doing. So yeah, 
we'll leave it there. So if you enjoyed, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe if you're new, tap that notification bell to be notified of all my videos, and you truly can be one of Kappa's convicts, or your convict head for the ladies, and yes, it is I, the Kappa convict, signing out. And as always, I salute you, my convicts and convicts, and I'll see you soon in another gameplay. Bye for now.